I'm Zion, I'm nine years old from Miami, Florida. I skateboard because it makes me happy and it's fun. When I started skating, I was three years old. I didn't get Zion into skateboarding. Zion got himself into skateboarding. My first board was a long board and then I got a penny board. He was on YouTube watching skateboarding, and his favorite skaters were Tor Padwell and Ryan Sheckler. And then my dad bought me a super cheap Target board. You know, he always said he bought him a cheap Target board. And one day he said he wanted a pro board, and I was like, what's a pro board? It was like a real skateboard. And we took him to the skate shop to get a board. We got home. All night, Zan was on the skateboard. All you heard on the concrete was clack, 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 the wheels knocking, knocking, Zion! Stop skating. And as they say, the rest is history. Every day he'd go in the driveway, he'd do his thing, and a friend of us said, oh, I just passed a place where there's a bunch of skaters. I think it's a skate park. And I was like, what? Where? Got in the car, went to Grand Central. This little boy got out of the car, and the look on his face was like he was in heaven. Smallest kid there. And I started asking him, I was like, is there anyone here that could teach my son to skate? His dad showed up and he was like, yo, my son's taking a weird affinity for skating. I don't really get it, but I want to find someone to coach him. He was like, well, you know, I really don't teach kids. You know, he gave me a, a couple of excuses and then he looked down at Zion and he said, but you know what? He looks like a really cool kid. Let's see what happened. He had such a fun time with me and he was super like responsive for a freaking three-year-old that I was like, sure, I'll do classes with him. Every day they'd skate together. Danny became his coach. Danny, his tricks are super hard and he tells me to learn them like, what? His tricks are like crazy. Danny would say to him, Zion, you could do this trick. And he was like, he always said, you crazy? I'm just a kid. And he was like, no, you could do it. Watching him makes me want to learn new tricks and stuff. Oh! Street skating is my favorite because I get to do a whole bunch of different tricks on a whole bunch of different obstacles. At four or five years old, he was doing things was like, hold up. What the hell is going on? It's like him in this board. You know, they, they belong together. I coached him for a little bit, but now I'd consider him just a good skate friend. We're in my closet right now, and this is probably my favorite room in the house because it's like a mini skate shop right here. He's a little man. Uh, I call him a little man. He thinks he's grown. This is Amelia, one of my snakes. She's not aggressive at all. She just rolls up in a ball most of the time. Rocco, he likes to sleep, eat, and then sleep again. He likes to move mostly at night since he's nocturnal. Yeah, this is probably my favorite out of the two of them. He's just a fun kid. He's a really smart kid. And he's just a kid that likes to have fun. Oh, I got a big one! I found the money hole! <laughs> oh, yeah, baby! He loves fishing. He plays soccer. He's great at basketball. You know, he does regular kids' stuff. But his passion is skateboarding. 
As a nine-year-old, Zion's the most mature young kid I know. Zion, no matter what, impresses everyone. I think it's his personality that wins the people over. I love it. He loves it's it. It's good. From my perspective, skateboarding is life. It teaches you everything you want to need about life. Everything. I mean, skateboard teach you persistence. If you fall down, get up. You gotta be patient. If you don't do something, do it to the best of your ability. You only have yourself to compete. It's crazy. Where are you from? From Florida. What part of Florida? Miami, Florida. What's the best city in America? Miami, Florida. Yeah, there you go. I wouldn't say my local skate scene is the biggest, but a lot of people like to skate here. And there's a lot of people learning how to skate here, and it's just really fun to skate with everybody here. The Miami skate scene is kind of fresh in a sense. I guess that's the way I want to put it. Post office. This is a place I've been skating since I was three years old. I would come here after school. There's a bunch of great skaters here. We just didn't have good parks. If you live in Miami, you had to drive 30 minutes to an hour to get to a really good park. When I first got involved with Zion, you had to pay $5 to go to skate park, which is, to me, is not right. I think skateboarding should be free for the kids. So Danny Fianzolita is my partner now with Nick Katz. He had an idea about an organization called Skate Free that we formed, which we would build parks that would be free for kids. And we just happened to get this spot downtown called Lot 11 that we're gonna build Miami's first skate plaza. We have a million two budget that we're working with and kids are gonna be over the moon when it's done. It's gonna have everything that kids have dreamed of. Instead of going to California, they're gonna have their own skate plaza in Miami that they can skate for free. I'm really excited about it because it's gonna have everything I love, street, bowl, everything. It's just gonna be a really flowy park. How far can Zion take his skating is entirely up to Zion. The whole family is behind him. They support me a lot with my skateboarding. His three-year-old little brother Jax wants to be like him. Jagger is his older brother, one of his older brother. He's into dancing, but he loves when Zion skate. They all support him. His older brother and his sisters are behind him. The future is bright for Zion. <laughs> I mean, I think the future is bright for Zion. Woodward is the mecca of skateboarding for kids. I think it's every kid's dream to go to Woodward. I've been to Woodward once when I was eight years old. First time he went there, he spent three weeks. He was like, yo, this is heaven. I learned so much new tricks there and made a bunch of friends. Last time he came back from Woodward, he came back killing it. Progression was like off the chain when he came back. My favorite thing to skate at Woodward was Target Plaza because it had stairs, rails, hubbas. I think this trip is very special. Being on the show means a lot to me because I've been watching the show since it practically started and now I'm on season 10. It makes me feel so happy to be on it. Might be one of Woodward's best season, I think. Right now, I'm just saying that, hopefully. On this season of Camp Woodward. Ah, season 10. Five, four, three, two, one, go. 40 seconds left. Keep on holding back, cake by the ocean. All right, look, I'm landing right here, and if I get it, you owe me a jewel. Yep, 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 that's the deal. I don't know what Fahrenheit is, but it's probably like 30. It's like 40, dude. Steaming out here. Ethan is my brother from another mother. I 
la 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 Let me get your number, right there. Okay. What are you needing this for? Skr, skr! I can't turn, I can't turn! Oh! Demonte, are you scared, Mega? I do not like the Mini Mega. It is a, it's a cool obstacle we have here to offer, but it's not totally for me. What the? That was gross. <laughs> what the? I'm not a flower, man. Bye bye. Fishy fishies, I will find you. He sucks at fishing, so like. What do you mean? I literally came to Woodward so we can do this to my board. Send it! My board Dax, butt focuses on lock. Shut up. Johnny's been trying to catch a butterfly for the last two weeks. Ah, oh, see? Oh my Can god, do you see those? Oh, this rail's cursed! Is he okay? I don't think so. Shut up, Chris! Hello, Walker Ducky. Hello. If you bite me, Margie, I swear. She's been trying to bite me all week. Hey. Is it raining? Yeah. Oh no. We're gonna go watch Dax try to wakeboard for the first time. It's gonna be sick. <laughs> yeah, Dax, you got it, baby. I'm about to go show these kids up. I'm gonna do the ramp first try. Hey, JP! I'm a lifeguard! It's not JP anymore, it's Trendy P. Put some on there. Hey, right here. Push the lens. Went so far on my bum. Oh! <sighs> I'm trying to go to sleep. <sighs> He's very caterpillary. I'm filming Miles. Camp Woodward film crew now. Snoop! Definitely fun to come to Woodward. Should come. <laughs>